Welcome back to Let's Play Yakuza 0. I'm Burning Dog Face. And we've just, uh, witnessed a really powerful ass kicking technique. Oh, yeah. I like the guy with the characters written all over his outfit, but, uh, that dude in the front, despite wearing green, looks terrible. I give you four out of ten, and only for the effort. Thuggish Coward. She's a martial artist, dude! You know what? It's 1988. I will let that one slide. Yeah. The texture is set to high. Everything looks kind of blurry. Good. Or maybe even ultra. Oops. Switch to beast style. Jump cut? Okay, that's much better. Actually, while I'm in here... Thing up. How do I drop this stupid thing? Move so slowly like this. Oh, no, that's not how that works. Uh, motorcycle. Fuck yeah. Okay, that was really bad, but, um, got the job done. When using Beast Style, uh, hold the bumper to guard, lets you withstand. A certain uh, enemy attacks at the resist guard. You will take a certain amount of damage. You're protected against attacks going from any direction. Hmm. Bolstering thy defense by equipping gear in the pause menu further reduces the damage you take with resist guard. Be sure to equip any gear you find. Well, there you go. They don't really go over it. They just tell you, hey, it's probably a good idea. Oh. Oh. Use B style move to pulverize the pack of cowards. <laughs> Fucking hell. The beast. Defeat an enemy with a weapon in beast style. Defeat an enemy with a counterattack in brawler style. Oop. Spoilers. Uh, the rusher. Defeat enemy after weaving in rush style. Fuck, I don't really do counterattacks, do I? Hmm. Shit. Top gear. Defeat enemy when your heat gauge is full. Oh, 
I really, really want her to jump here, you, and try to kill him for defending her. You know, there's a supervillain, uh, at least one, whose literal superpower is the fact that he can mimic anything he's seen done. I want to say that's Taskmaster. I'm just saying, he just perfectly replicated her fighting style after watching her fight a dude for, like, six seconds. He's got a lapel pin. I wonder if he's a Yakuza. Doesn't seem to have any uh, thing on it, any details. Maybe he just wants to look cool. Oops. Oopsie. <laughs> now, once again, a real good job by the translators. I mean, it's not just that they've avoided, like, awkwardly worded sentences. It's, uh... It sounds like really natural English. Like that, for example. Uh, there's a whole thing about how translating idioms literally makes no sense at all outside of the culture in which they are idioms. Uh, so the phrase, a diamond in the rough, might not make any sense to someone who it doesn't, who isn't, you know, from an English-speaking country. So I'm assuming that they said something else there. Sorry, I'm thinking too much about this. Uh, yeah. Yes. I mean, I don't mean to brag, but... Oh, yeah, actually. Like life in prison or a bullet in the head. What's this obsession with me getting stabbed about? There's a pier. I thought we were like in the middle of Tokyo or something. Ooh, is it a houseboat? It's a date, I guess. Oh, I guess I've already got, like, six games of future laid out.
You know, I admire his enthusiasm, if not the long-windedness of every scene that involves him. Get out of here. No, um... Am I in control? No, okay. I just sat there for like five seconds. Yeah, okay. It is about time I get around to that, isn't it? Oh, theater? Oh, it's it's got to be this one, right? Theater Square Alley? Wait, uh, huh. Do you know who this guy is? They named the series after him. That's a terrible joke. I'm sorry. I was wondering about that, since the only actual store on the map here is a bowling alley. You know, that's not something you can exactly move around real easily. Here you, you're gonna have to fight the guy. Just knock him out and get it over with. Ugh, sorry. I don't know why, but sometimes after I drink coffee, I get very yawny. remember what fucking button it is to uh, counter-attack. Uh, shit. It's not in here. Fuck. Balls. Shit. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Fuck. Let me clear this distraction out of the way. Uh... Shit! Well, balls. I don't remember the button. Or, uh... Counter-attacking right after I get punched. I know I have to do it when Kiryu flashes red. Is it why? Oh, 
Okay. Wait, you have to mash uh, X, Y, or B. Thank you for moving back into position. I am terrible with this style. Let's end this. Hit points are inexcusable in this dungeon. Yeah, I've just got this guy killed, but okay. You know, whatever. Priorities. <laughs> Sorry. But no. I can't think of anything funny. His favorite porn website? Don't get too excited, it's just Pornhub. <laughs> Hakua building on Chichi Fuku Street. Okay. Hakua. I assume it's not Hakua like it would be in uh, English. I didn't accidentally skip to the end that time because well, I didn't see the other bracket, frankly. Aha! Yes, an actual waypoint. But uh, I should find a fucking like dinner place or something. Fill up my health bar. I wonder if they have like snacks or something in the bowling alley. Used to be a bowling alley near here that actually had some really good nachos. Holy fuck. Nice man's bag. And we're running. My bad. I find it weird you can't actually go to that guy's store, the Café Blend. Is that Leon Kennedy's sweet jacket from Resident Evil 4? I guess between 88 and 2004 it was stolen from this guy. I just saved the game. Nope, nope. Kiryu's personal sense of honor will not allow him to go into the wrong bathroom. Or even the right one. He's just going to urinate into this bowling ball. 
is the next person who puts their heads inside. God damn it! Ah, uh, I could not keep a straight face. I don't actually want to bowl, so I'm just going to get out of here. I wonder if they, if they uh, changed the model so that he's wearing those dumbass shoes. Oh no! I didn't start the timer. Well, shit. Sort. Oh. I thought sort would be an auto sort, but whatever. You know what? There. So, uh... I guess tune in to the next episode of Let's Play Yakuza 0 when we track down lunch. Check out that mysterious meeting in the uh, middle of nowhere. And then... Uh, head off to check out Tachibana real estate. Or at least find their goons. See you then, Burning Dog fans. Later!